Christians a scholar found words from the Bible behind the Arabic owns a close analysis of pictures representing fragments of a Quran manuscript revealed the trace of Coptic letters behind the Arabic words. The finding was the result of a research conducted by French scholar Dr. Ella Honor Sellard through images of a palimpsest page, a manuscript on which later writing has been superimposed on a face to earlier writing, sold by Christie's more than ten years ago. After noticing the faint letters, she contacted the auction house which, following further analysis, identified the Coptic text as words of the Old Testament's Book of Deuteronomy, part of the Torah and the Christian Old Testament. Ms. Sellard, who is attached to the College de France, said, This is a very important discovery for the history of the Quran and early Islam. This is a very important discovery for the history of the Quran and early Islam. French scholar Dr. Eleanor Sellard, We have here a witness of cultural interactions between different religious communities. Christie's believe the manuscript is likely to have been produced in Egypt, home of the Coptic community, at the time of the Arab conquest. While the writing style of the Quran scribe dates it to around the 8th century, it's impossible to state when the almost disappeared Coptic writing was jotted down. The only way to determine how old the fragments are is by conducting carbon-14 testing, but they could ruin the thin fragments. The auction house said that the palimpsest resonate with the historical reality of religious communities in the Near East and as such are an invaluable survival from the earliest centuries of Islam. Getty Christie's believe the manuscript is likely to have been produced in Egypt. Christie's specialist Roman Pingano added, It's quite extraordinary. Once you know it's there, you can only see it. It becomes so obvious, we missed it at the beginning. It's fascinating, particularly because it's the only example where you have an Arabic text, on top of a non-Arabic text, and what's even more fascinating is it is on top of passages from the Old Testament, it shows the contact between communities in the first centuries of Islam, it's very relevant, yet the Coptic community is still active in Egypt. The practice of writing over old text was common in the Byzantine and Greek worlds as then it was in use a much stronger material to write, parchment. Mr. Pingano explained, parchment is very strong, it doesn't suffer too much, it's sensitive to humidity but very solid, at the time it was erased the parchment was probably like new and it's only with centuries passing that the ink which sank into the parchment provides this ghost image we see, those who want to try and grab this extraordinary piece of history will have to be ready to bid above the guide price established by Christie's, starting from £80,000 to £120,000, on Thursday.